guys, it's Nicole Need Crosley with Murdoch Man Wearing Company, where we are passionate about making an impact through real estate. We have a great house to show you down here in Pocatello today. It is 416, 416 Johnson Avenue in Pocatello. We are on the west side of Pocatello, down where you have all of these fabulous vintage houses that have been fixed up and remodeled and made to look like new, but they still look like they're built in the 1920s. This is built in 1930. And one of the great things is you get mature vegetation. Look at all the flowers and the great grass. This ha this house has a fully fenced yard and plenty of space to put some patio furniture out here and enjoy the outdoors. As you first come in the front door, you've got a sunroom. This faces the west, so you'll have nice, lots of nice sun as you go towards the evening. And look at this fun door with the uh, glass, stained glass treatment on it. You walk into the family room, dining room. You have a great view out of the, out through the sunroom. These really neat paned windows that get, will give you lots of light. They are vinyl windows here. We've got a few vinyl and we've got a few vintage original windows to this 1930 house. We've got vinyl windows right here. This leads into the kitchen. So you've got a dining room area. This leads down to the basement. We're going to go through the bedrooms. You've got two bedrooms up here. You've got a master with a walk-in closet just off to the right. It sits on the west side of the house and the north, so it's not going to get blasted with sun first thing in the morning. Nice tall ceilings and uh, vinyl windows here on the west and the north side, but they also kept one of the original, um, I would say it's original leaded glass um, window here on this side. You've got a walk-in closet and on the left you've got a Jack and Jill bathroom. So the two bedrooms upstairs um, share this bath. You've got a claw foot tub and a window for some nice natural light. And then you've got the second bedroom here with another closet and a window on the north side. So both of your bedrooms will stay cool through the day because they're on the north side of the house. So this is a circular walk through. As you come through, you come from the living room, dining room, in here to this awesome kitchen. This, I'm gonna guess, I'm not positive, but this looks like a concrete countertop because it's one of my favorite styles with a rough edge. And they've got some rock that they've updated. You've got appliances and a window that uh, faces the south. So nice lot of natural sunlight from the south side into this kitchen. And you've got a really fun Lazy Susan. And as you look at that, look at the beautiful floor. They've done a really cool two-tone floor through there. And through the kitchen is the laundry room. You've got plenty of folding space and storage space. It goes out two steps that go down to the deck. And this looks out uh, to the yard on the east side. So you get nice morning sun there in your uh, laundry room. So we're going to take a walk right back around the corner down the stairs. Like I said, this is a, this is a four bed, two bath house built in 1930. It's got a four stair heat and it has central AC. So at the bottom of the stairs, you have got a family room, living room area with lots of outlets and plenty of space would make a great theater room. You've got a full bath right here with a um, shower. Instead of a shower tub con combo, you've got a shower. Then you've got uh, another room here plus storage back behind. Here is your, um, looks like an updated, that was definitely not a 1930 uh, heating system. So you've got an updated HVAC with four stair and um, air conditioning. You also have another bedroom back there at the west end of the house. So we're going to go through here. You can access the backyard through a great little workroom. So in this workroom, you have got a sink and workbenches and the door that goes to the outside. A little patio first as you come through the door. 
And then they also have the patio there on the north side of the yard that goes up to the laundry room. You've got some grass here and you've got a fire pit and you've got some side yard with some beautiful flowers and vegetation. So if you are interested in taking a look at this house, give me a call. My information's at the bottom. This is here at 416. Let's see, I lost my address, 416 South Johnson Avenue in Pocatello.